Hello, welcome to this video. It's Leonard here from DetailLeonard.com and in today's video tutorial, I'm going to share with you the simplest way to buy crypto using your PayPal funds in Nigeria. Okay, so if you have some PayPal funds and then you can withdraw it to your bank account um, directly without going through a third party that will even charge you less than what that PayPal phone is worth, then the easiest way to do that is following this tutorial, the step-by-step -step guide that I'm giving you in this tutorial, all right? I am using Nigeria as a case study. It doesn't mean that you cannot do this wherever you find yourself. If you're in Bangladesh, wherever country you find yourself, in as much as you have PayPal funds that you cannot withdraw directly to your bank account, the easiest way to go about that, to be able to convert it to your bank account, is going through the cryptocurrency way okay so you use the paypal to buy cryptocurrency and then from cryptocurrency you can withdraw it directly to your bank account all right and that is exactly what i am going to share with you in this video okay so if you are new to my channel and you love videos about making money online about crypto trading and investing then consider subscribing hit the notification bell to be notified each time videos like this are published on this channel all right and just to let you know subscription is actually free and it won't take you more than one second just hit the subscribe button all right so that is it and let's jump right into the video okay um so the reason why i'm doing this video is i've um seen a situation where some nigerians who have been paid via paypal okay uh, and then some persons in other african countries who have been paid via paypal they are looking for a way to convert their paypal to their bank account and they cannot so the easiest way to go about it is to use that PayPal funds that you have to buy cryptocurrency, okay? You can buy Bitcoin, you can buy USDT, you can buy whatever cryptocurrency asset that you want, okay, using the PayPal funds. And then at the end of the day, um, once you have the cryptocurrency asset that you bought, you can easily convert that to your bank account, all right? And to be able to achieve this, we need first you already have the paypal funds okay i want to assume that you already have the paypal funds and then the second thing you need you need an exchange that can actually accept that paypal that you want to use okay and the exchange i'm going to share with you is called paxful okay i will leave a link to sign up if you don't have an account with paxful i will leave a link in the video description okay so i'm going to share this exchange with you and then walk you step by step on how to be able to use it okay so once again the exchange is called paxful all right so you just go to password.com use the link if you don't have an account with password already use the link in the video description to be able to access the exchange once you sign up for an account make sure you get your account verified and then from there you can use your paper to buy funds from the password and then from password you can easily convert those funds that you've gotten to your bank account directly okay all right so um now the reason for this another reason for this is because if you are trying to sell this paypal to somebody for instance if you're in nigeria um you can actually get up to 580 per one dollar okay per one dollar so why sell it for 400 why sell it to somebody for 320 and stuff like that so the best way is just to leverage on the cryptocurrency platform and use it to do that all right so if i go to my paxful exchange all right i have a verified account with paxful already and here i'll come and use the buy tap here all right so here you see where it says on the exchange here they probably have a mobile app you can do this if you downloaded the mobile app from the play store or your app store already so once i click on this buy tab all right so if i click on the buy tab so it will bring us to this interface okay so this is where we are going to carry out all of the transactions and what we want to do is um, for instance here now to proceed you need to select the asset you want to buy okay you can buy bitcoin you can buy ethereum you can buy Tether and the rest so uh, in my own case i want to buy usdt so i'm going to use usdt to demonstrate this okay so one usdt is equal to one dollar all right so if you have uh, um, let's say a thousand dollars on your paypal account it means that you can get a usdt worth a thousand dollars okay though there are some fees that are attached to it all right um that are, um that comes with it as well so um the next thing i want to do is um pay via where you say pay via or payment method okay you can go ahead and choose all payment method you know bank transfer and all the payment method that um Pax will actually support all right but in this case i'll just go ahead and click on it we don't want to use all payment method okay so we'll just be specific all right and go ahead and type in paypal here all right so paypal we'll go ahead and select paypal 
all right so once i type in paypal i select paypal then you want to spend how much okay if it is 100 usdt or let's say we want to spend um sorry if it is 100 um usd okay you go ahead and put in there if it is 200 usd if it is 1000 usd whatever it is you go ahead and put in the amount here, okay so i just put in 1000 usd there, all right and then the location the offer location um, by default it is selecting my own location here okay so you can actually go and change the location but it doesn't mean all right in as much as you get the seller around this area it doesn't mean so i'll go ahead and click on find offer all right so once i click on find offer you see a lot of persons here okay um you are going to buy from this person all right this is the person's username and then you are going to pay with uh paper okay and um, the average trade speed is about 14 minutes and then the rate per, uh, per tether all right so the rate uh, this person is selling at uh, one dollar 17 cent per dollar all right so these are uh, the charges that i actually say that comes with this all right so because we are paying with paypal or whatever payment method you are using this person's actually sell it above um, what you should be expecting all right so instead of buying one um, usd for one dollar um, for one USDT, you are now buying one USDT for a dollar um, seventeen cent. All right, so um, which is still far better than you know just selling it um, anywhere to random persons. Okay, and then the next person here is selling for a dollar um, four cent. Okay, a dollar four cent, and um, it's only two offers we have here, so you can go ahead and check okay between these two persons who do you want to buy from okay this person has carried out and has about uh, this person has about um, um 1351 um, thumbs up this person has 694 right meaning that this person has been long in business and a lot of persons get to trust this person okay so we can go ahead and um, go with this option so now because the location is nigeria we only have two offers here right so we can buy from this person now another thing you should notice is that this person was seen um 33 minutes ago this person was seen eight minutes ago so um i, I prefer to go with this um, second option okay so you can go ahead and click on buy um tether from this person all right so the limit you can buy here another thing you need to look at the limit you can buy is from hundred dollars to one thousand dollars okay meaning that if you want to buy less than hundred dollars you cannot buy from this person and then the limit for this person is from 50 to about 2489 okay so if you want to buy anything less than 50 dollars you can't buy from any of these so it must be from 50 upward and then this person hundred to a thousand all right so i'll go ahead and click on buy all right all right so it brings us once i click on buy it brings us to this page all right so once we are on this page okay um you go ahead and specify how much you want to buy all right so since you specify 1000 already it is 1000 that is here um if there is any need to modify this you can still go ahead and, and do that okay so you can go ahead and modify that now because this person is not selling um one dollar for one usdt definitely your one thousand dollars will be getting you about 714 usdt all right so you are going to be getting 714 usdt and then you just go ahead and click on buy now so you, you can come down here and see that um, um the person is selling uh, it is actually 40 percent above the market rate okay so that means this person is selling one dollar to um what's it called 40 cent actually one dollar forty cent one dollar is, is selling it for one dollar one usdt for one dollar forty cent all right so um and then the trade time limit is about 30 minutes or thereabout okay so you just go ahead and click on buy now all right so we'll just click on buy now all right so to try this ad i will just go with the 100 usdt okay so i click on buy now so i'm going to press 100 usdt and once i click on buy now um let's say automated trade all right got it um so here they say automated trade welcome to the new automated trade system which enable faster and safer trade please provide all necessary information required by the other party okay so we got this thank you and then we are getting 71 for 100 um, usdt okay and then we'll have 30 minutes to make this payment
Um, the next thing you need to do is to follow these steps that has been highlighted here for you. All right. So um, this seller wants to see the balance first before he can actually release he or she can actually release the <laughs> payment, the account you are going to make the payment uh, to. All right. And there are reasons for this because. A lot of persons will do this without having funds on their PayPal account and stuff like that. So first, you will need to upload your proof of payment, okay? So here the seller, is, uh, the buyer is saying a screenshot of your PayPal account showing your available balance. So you need to take, go to your PayPal account, log into your PayPal account, take a screenshot, all right? And then upload it here, all right? Just take a screenshot of only the balance and upload it here. Then after uploading it, you send to the vendor. All right, so the vendor will verify the document you have submitted and then share the payment information so you can make the payment. So once the vendor verifies that, um, he or she will share the email address you're going to send your payment to, okay? So vendor will review and process your payment. If anything is okay, they will release. If everything is okay, they will release the data for you, okay, from Ecros. Um, all of these things are handled automatically except for the upload. You need to upload this thing. The vendor needs to verify and then release the payment um, uh, details for you. You make the payment and after that the vendor verifies that he or she has received the payment and then you are credited with the funds that you made payment for. All right. So once you are credited with the funds you made payment for, the next thing is how do you sell these funds to your bank account? All right. So if I come back, all right, um, I will just let this be. Um, let me see if I can, if it's something I can come back to. All right. So after you go through this process and the funds are now available on your Paxful account, the next thing you want to do, the same way you clicked on the buy, you come in here and click on sell. All right. So once you click on sell, this time around, we are going to select um, Tether again. Okay, we want to sell Tether. And here you can see, despite the fact that you paid a lot of fee, you can actually sell your one USDT for 581 naira. This is in the Nigerian naira, okay? Um, this is calculated based on my location, all right? You can sell one USDT for 581 naira. And this is something, if you are selling to a third party, they would have bought from you at, um, let's say, they would have bought at... Um, for hundreds, they would have bought at 420, 450, and the rest. But you can sell that here for 580, and this can cover up for whatever fee you pay to buy um, the crypto asset with your PayPal funds. Okay, and then you want to use bank transfer. Okay, so you go ahead and click on bank transfer, and you go ahead and find offer. All right. So once you click on find offers, these are people who are ready to buy from you, all right? So you just look at the limit. This person is ready to buy from 10,000 to, this is 5 million, right? 10,000 to 5 million. This is from 10,000 again to 5 million, 10,000 to 20 million. So whatever funds you have, you can go ahead and sell to any of these persons you're seeing here, okay? This person is selling, buying at a 578, 577, 578. Um, this one is 610, all right? And, and so on. So you can just go ahead and look for an offer that best um, suits you and then sell to that person, okay? Sell your USD to that person and you are good to go. All right. If you don't want to sell your USDT on password, you can actually withdraw your USDT. I have another platform. So I have another platform called OKX. So once I come to the OKX account, I will probably leave a link in the video description if you want to sign up, okay? I'll click on Buy Crypto. And when I click on Buy Crypto, I want to come in here. It brings us to the P2P interface, okay? So I want to come in here and click on Sell. And as you can see here, you can actually sell at 583, 583, and so on. So you can look at the limit and then see how you can sell to any of these persons, all right? I like selling with... Uh, with um, with OKS because the offer here is far, um, is bigger than that of Paxful when it comes to selling, okay? So I can buy my crypto or my USDT with um, my PayPal account, with my PayPal funds on Paxful, then transfer the funds from Paxful to my OKS account and then I can sell it here directly to my bank account. All right. So basically, that is all I needed to share with you in this video. Um, if there is anything you are stuck with, you can always use the comment section. I will see how I can help you out. Then if you want to learn more about crypto trading and investing, 
Then I have Zoom meetings that I do have on a weekly basis where people get to ask me questions and I get to provide answers to those questions. So to get access to those Zoom link, you will need to join the Telegram group. The link will probably be in the video description. Once again, if you are new to this channel, you like videos like this, okay, um, just consider subscribing, hit the notification bell um, to be the first to be notified each time videos like this are published. And if you gain any value from this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next video.